in this module we will talk about a special type of organelle which does not have a membrane around it the ribosome. Ribosomes are made up of two subunits the large subunit and the small subunit. These organelles basically are responsible for translating the language of nucleotides into language of proteins or language of amino acids. Ribosomes can be free or attached to endoplasmic reticulum. We saw that in the animation also that there were ribosomes which are attaching themselves to the endoplasmic reticulum. Ribosomes are also found in the mitochondria and chloroplasts. These are another type of cell organelle which we will talk about later. The basically these organelles they are responsible for recognizing the RNA molecule which has been released from the nucleus. That RNA is carrying a message in it that what protein cell needs to make. There is a sequence of events in which this protein production happens. I will describe it very briefly in this module because we are going to talk about it in great detail when we talk about protein synthesis. Ribosomes, when the RNA is first released from the nucleus, the small ribosomal subunit binds it. That is basically the subunit that recognizes the messenger RNA. It binds it and then the larger subunits assembles onto this complex which is at the moment composed of messenger RNA and, and the small subunit of ribosome. Ribosomes basically catalyze the reaction in which two amino acids are linked together by a peptide bond. This bond formation is catalyzed by an RNA molecule present in the large subunit of the ribosome and it is not the protein which is catalyzing this reaction. So the enzymatic activity of ribosome is due to an RNA molecule. When the large subunit assembles on the complex which is formed by union of a small ribosomal subunit and the messenger RNA, there is another type of RNA that comes and it brings the amino acids attached to it. These type of RNAs are called the transfer RNAs. They, these RNAs, they sit on the messenger RNA, the small subunit checks the whole complex checks the compatibility. We have talked about the, the nucleotides, A nucleotide and G nucleotides, C and T nucleotides. In case of RNA, it will be a U nucleotide. There is the, the, this complex checks whether these nucleotides are maintaining, following the rule of complementarity or not. And when this rule is, when they realize the rule has been followed, these, the amino acids carried on these. Uh, these transfer RNA molecules are linked together. As I mentioned, this reaction is catalyzed by RNA present in the ribosome and a protein, a, a protein, a polypeptide chain starts forming. 